What's going on guys, Aussie here, welcome back to a brand new video. So, EA released 90 plus player picks today, and I'll tell you what, I think it's one out of three, which is pretty decent. Last time we opened 90 plus packs, it didn't go well. It did not go well, or it didn't go as expected, let's say. So I'm hoping these player picks are a bit different. Oh, oh, okay. Untradeable. Untradeable, guessing. There you go. And please don't say untradeable. Thank you. I was about to say. For a second there, I was about, like, nah, 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 nah. This guy's pack luck is absolutely ridiculous. I say clicked on objectives. Last time, I remember when I did player picks, I accidentally clicked on the, what's called, the store. Thinking it was a pack. But first one is going to be pretty decent. I tell you what, chat. I tell you what. Nabry, Courtois, and Carver Hell as the first one. Okay. The real question is, the real question is, who is he picking? You go for Nabry, which is obviously the most usable card there, I believe. Carver Hell is probably second. And then Courtois. But I doubt he's ever going to go for Courtois. So it's Nabry or Carver Hell. He wants Carver Howe. He wants the, you know, the highest rated. But at the same time, Carver Howe is a really, really good player in game. That's pretty decent to start off, to be fair. This is the team he's giving up, okay? He's got the 290 overalls, which you don't really need because, look, he's got the 76 overalls. He's got 78, 77, 79s and stuff like that. It's only an 83 rated team and 60 chem as well is reasonable, I must say. But I'm going to quickly look at this guy's team as well before we do get into the pack because I always like to look at a person's team simply to see what they're working with, what we could potentially obviously get him and see what would actually be usable in the guy's team. I see a road to the final Dembele, rip in the chat boys, rip in the chat. Valverde, another rip. Militao, another rip. Benzema, you got the Sanchez Keen. The gold Neymar, oof, that's going to hurt. That is going to hurt. Gold Neymar in August? Okay, I see how it is, I see how it is. Maybe we can, you know, casually pack you a team of the season, Neymar. I'll tell you what, right? These 90 pluses, okay? Even though this is not the greatest pack. Yeah, Rafa is pretty decent. Hulk is also pretty decent. But at the same time, it's like, they're not giving us 90s. They're actually giving us decently high rated. So, I will take that as a little W. Now, I'm not sure what you want to go off here. I'm guessing it's probably Hulk. Best, you know, highest overall and stuff like that. And Hulk is probably a better option than Rafa, to be fair. But I'm going to see. It's going to take him quite a while, isn't it? He's going to go Rafa. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. As I said, the Hulk is probably the better player to pick. But I, I can understand why you picked Rafa. You did the player of the year. How you enjoy Nine games played. Eight goals. Four assists. Okay. I see you. I see you. You also got the Saint, the Football birthday Mbappe, the Neymar. There's not much that can really go into this team. Let's all be fair, right? But maybe we could pack him someone absolutely outrageous. And probably get like a, you know, a Virgil. A Virgil would slide into that team over David Luiz, I guess. But come on. Let's see. Let's see what we're working with. EA servers, you know. Why is there a cheeky Ramos just chilling? I could, you know, potentially say a pack to Ramos, but I'm not going to do that, okay? I'm not going to do that. Come on. Player pick is taking a long time to open. Oh, this is probably the worst one we've had, right? Gabriel's very usable, by the way. And I would probably pick Gabriel over anyone else there. But this is, yeah, hands down, this is probably the worst one we've had. Are you picking Odegaard? Now, you have to think it as this, right? If it's for SBCs, Odegaard is so much more easier for Ken Wise, obviously, because he's from a decent league. But at the same time, the other player was a bit more usable. you got the Joao Felix. The Ronaldo. Yeah, this is the team we see multiple times. He's allowed me to open his pack. God knows how many times. Mbappe, the De Bruyne, pretty much overpowered team. Pretty much the meta team, if anything. And there's not much that can actually slide into this team. But let's see what we can actually pack in. Maybe it's someone outrageous and he probably can sell someone else and then move on after that. He's got beat. This is another guy, by the way, with a circle as select. So come on. Please, EA, please. All I want is one, like, outrageous player. Oh, look at it. Oh, my God. I literally... Wait, what? Oh, wait. Isn't it? I thought it... Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I thought it was 90 plus team of the season packs, no? Is it 90 plus player picks? I am so confused. I thought for... Wait, what? I swear I saw 90 plus team of the season player picks. Is it not? I'm, I, well, I mean, I guess it's not. So you have the option of Marquinhos and Fernandez. I honestly thought it was 90 plus team of the season player picks. Not... Nah, just 90 plus player picks. Okay, that is something I didn't know. But it is what it is. Marquinhos or Fernandez. 
I'm going to guess Marquinhos. It has to be Marquinhos. He wouldn't go for Fernandez. Let's all be fair. This is the guy's team he's actually giving up. Oh, no. We just had Sayul in the other player pick. And usually when we give up a player, that's the player we actually come back with. So this might not actually end well, but we'll see where it goes. Come on. We are going to see the guy's team. As I said, we always see the guy's team just to see what he's working with. Is that Maradona? I haven't seen this Maradona in so long to the point that I... Li oh my God, you played 1,855 games with him. Okay. You've also got the, that 99. I'm telling you boys, that 99 De Bruyne is just better than the team of the season. I don't care what anyone says about the stats and stuff like that. When we go into in-game, he just plays better for some reason. Okay. This ain't actually too bad, to be fair, because Vela is low-key usable. It's just a weaker foot that lets him down. You got the Kovacic, which was decent at the, at the time. And you got, obviously, the Carver Howe as well. But he is going to go for the highest rated. Wait, this guy's giving up 94 Telis and Mertens. What? I feel like this is an overkill like hell. Of, like, look how many non rares he's got in this team. But let's go. Let's see what we can actually get for him. I want to see what he's working with. I don't think we've opened your pack in a very long time. As far as I know. Unless we actually packed you, uh, what's called, open your pack last time. And I can't remember. So we've got the 99 De Bruyne. Okay. Suzoko, Hernandez, Blanc, Baby Schmeichel. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. But he has got the casual, you know, Furlan, Mendy and Trent in the left back and right back positions. But come on. Please. Please. I tell you what, this is so similar to the other pack. Who was the other player? We packed Solmani, it went Hulk, and there was a 93, I think. Was it Rafa? I think it was Rafa. This is so similar to the other pack, though. But I'm going to guess you're going to go for Hulk. Yeah, it is going to be Hulk. He does the thing where we control, control it at the same time. Smart guy, smart guy. But not bad for SBCs. Okay. And the Herrera, you're honestly begging, begging for someone to win and i doubt it i honestly doubt it i can't see psg winning over Bayern, but ronaldo untradeable whoa you actually recently packed him as well 17 games 31 goals the guy's causing damage let's just say that but let's see what we can actually get out of this player pick come on ea i need like a 97 no i tried to predict it but it just went all downhill as soon as you see by the way two goalkeepers in one player pick you already know the whole pack is going to be an L, apart from that one person that is going to obviously be decent, Thiago. Now, Thiago's, once again, I really doubt it's going to fit in this guy's team. It's probably going to use for SPCs. Oh, it's a concept team. Has he done something? I'm guessing he gave away one of the players. He did. He gave away Martial. Okay. Hey, I'm all for it, but at the same time, it kind of depends what you get back, right? So, Opomakano. I haven't seen this in so, so long. So Zoko, Pogba, you got a Bruno Fernandez. So you actually play Bruno in the cam position. Okay, I see you, I see you. You got the Pogba and Zoko in the CDM position, I'm guessing as well. But let's see. Player pick, 90 plus player pick, please. Okay, so this is going to be our first one that, you know, is going to be a pretty big W where they can actually get into people's teams. You could go for Son or you go for Hernandez. Now, I can't really... Did he have Mendy? I'm not sure if he had Mendy. If he had Mendy, that's why he didn't pick Hernandez. But Son is definitely, definitely usable. Oh, this guy's quality is really nice. Okay. Neymar or Zerbiel? Ooh. Untradeable? Tradable. 2.7 mil. Okay. He's tradable as well. This guy's luck doesn't seem crazy. And he's got a pretty decent team as well. The Joao, Felix, the Dembele, and the Junior. Chilling on the bench. You got yourself one hell of a super subs, haven't you? But let's see, 3k coins, I don't know what happened there. Not a lot of games played as well. Player picks, come on, please. Oh my god, bro, as soon as I saw a winter refresh. I remember when this card, by the way, was going for so much, it was crazy. Because people was overhyping it. But I'm going to guess he's probably going to go for David, surely, a 94 overall. And he's not even a bad player in-game as well. But yeah, that Ebra card was extremely, extremely overhyped. Like, he went for around 800k, 900k on, I think it was Xbox. Please don't do it. Please don't do it. Please pick David for me. Don't. I was about to say, if he picked the Ebra, I'm walking out. All right, let's see what the guy's team is working with. He's got the Morris. Oh, once again, once again, row to the final Dembele. Big rips. Big, big rips. This card, even though it's still good, it could have been absolutely unbelievable. But Barcelona letting us down. Big rips, big rips. But 43k coins, a decent amount of games played as well. Let's see what we get. Come on. Okay, okay. For me, 
top five uh, fullbacks in the game, without a doubt. You could even say top three right backs in the game, Lala. But Tafari is obviously the highest rated. So the real question is, are you going to go for rating or are you going to go for Lala? It's your decision. It's your decision. Lala or Tafari? Lala or Tafari? He's looking at the Lala stats. He's eyeing him out. He's like, oh, decisions, decisions to be made. Come on, bro. You're going to have to pick one. He's going to go Lala, is he? Imagine he just goes Pereira. He just trolls everyone. He just goes Pereira. Like, why are we talking about Pereira? He is going to go for rating. Understandable. What happened to your team? Wait, what? What am I looking at? What happened? He pretty much gave away his whole team at this point. This is one of those ones where I'm going to guess you're probably like completely. What am I looking at? Look how many games played. This team. Look at the games played interesting someone you know was splashing a bit of cash let's just say that there's someone splashing a bit of cash anyone good it's lagged completely oh my god and he's gonna get this kind of luck when he barely plays the game please go for sanchez do not do this to me yes there you go me being portuguese him being portuguese the little link up is there obviously sanchez is definitely the way to go that's kind of cute low-key but we'll see we'll move we'll move all right you got this messi you got the sozoko the zander dembele Junior de Joao Felix as well. What do you actually want? Ronaldo? I got you. I got you. Don't worry. I got you. All right. That's the only player and Neymar with Mbappe as well could obviously fit in that team. Maybe a cheeky 99 De Bruyne as well. Wouldn't be too bad. I'm going to get, I'm going to get to Orsic is probably the way to go here. But I don't know, man. Orsic was so good at some point. But the three-star skill moves just does not make him insanely usable this year. Yeah, his dribbling is outrageous. Yeah, his shooting is nice. His passing is nice. His pace is nice. But when it comes down to skill moves, creating angles with like flip flats, running scoop turns, he just hasn't got it in the locker. But I'm going to guess he is definitely the way to go here. I'm probably going to pick this for you. There's no way you want Mertens, surely. No way. I'm going to pick it for you. I'm going to do your favor, okay? And Orsic is your guy. Sorry about the quality, by the way, but there's not much you can do when it comes off the share play. But this guy is giving up two very, very high rated and he's not really giving up like a great team. Like if you really look at this team, you only see the two team of the seasons and pretty much everyone else is garbage. Let's all be fair. But let's see what this guy's team is before we do get into it. I want to see what is this guy working with? Because he's giving up in Handanovic and he's also giving up another high rated. But yeah. Fakir, Delglish, Gattuso. That's interesting. I haven't seen a Gattuso for a long time. You got the Delaney as well with the Maradona. Laporte and Varane. Headline of Varane. Oh my God, I completely forgot this Laporte was even a thing. Honest to God. He hasn't played a lot of games either. So maybe the pack clock is low key there, if you know what I mean. Come on. It's typical, right? It's typical. I'm telling you, boys, do not give up a team of the season player because you, above 90 because you will literally get him back. This is like, how many times have we seen this happen? How many times? He gave up a Handanovic. He got the Handanovic. Like, it's just typical. Typical, typical EA. All right, let's see what he's working with. Did I see? Oh, my God. Once again, I haven't seen this card in someone's team. I haven't seen this in a long time either. You've only played three games with him, to be fair. You got a Modric. Uh, Lewandowski is he pack pulled? He is pack pulled. Forty six games, thirty six goals. Oh, oh, you're hoping someone wins. Let's just say that. But come on, seven k coins. He hasn't got a lot of coins. Play a pick. Come on, ninety plus. This has to be good, surely. Son Rashford. Okay, I'm gonna guess Son is probably the better option here. Even though, oh, I was about to click a right stick on Rashford. I, I don't. You can pick Son. It's fine. Don't worry. All right, but Rashford has got a five star, five star on that card. That's what makes that card really good. But I'm guessing Son is probably the way to go for my guy. Yes, it is. That's pretty decent. That's like what a second Son. All right, so this is going to be the last one. The quality is actually pretty decent to end off as well. Dolgleish, Pep, Yashin. What happened? What happened to your team? That's the real question. This is one of those ones where he's completely done with FIFA. He's giving up everything at this point to see who he can get. And I tell you what. I'm going to pick it before, you know, he does something bad. 
But the Stegen was definitely the one to go for. And that's not bad to end it off, to be fair to you. But an overall rating out of 10 for these packs, I would actually rate it like an 8.5, maybe even a 9. These packs were good, but they weren't absolutely insane. It's not one of those ones that you just casually pack like a 99 De Bruyne, a 99 CR7, or even like a 98 Neymar or 97. I can't remember what he is. But either way, they weren't bad. They were pretty decent, especially value-wise. It was nice. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Leave a like, leave a comment, and for now, peace.